Welcome back to CBS 7. Under one of the largest jumbotrons in the world, it was one of the smallest high schools in the state of Texas who put on a show tonight. It was Grand Falls Royalty against Milford at AT&T Stadium, and this one belonged to the Cowboys. Coming into the six-man Division II state championship game, Grand Falls Royalty head coach Joe Helms was worried. Not worried about the game, but everything that came with it. We were worried about all the, the hoopla that goes on with going to state. You know, we had you guys out every stinking day. A number of things that we're really not accustomed to, and, and I was concerned with how the kids were going to respond, but, uh, you know, laser focus. The Cowboys never flinched. Grand Falls Royalty rolled out to a 30-0 lead with touchdowns from Julian Helms, Nieves Rodriguez, and Junior Marquez. It was typical Grand Falls Royalty football. That's what, that's what we've done all, all year, you know, and, and we knew coming in that, uh, we, we can't, we couldn't reinvent the wheel. You know, we had to do what, what we do, and we're a strong defensive team. Uh, you know, we, we onside most every possession. You know, we, we try to put the hammer down on people, and, and the kids executed it, it did a phenomenal job today. Grand Falls Royalty scored on every possession, racking up over 550 yards of total offense in route to a 73-28 blowout over Milford. I'm just glad that everyone on this team left it all on the field and they gave it everything they got. I'm proud of these guys, and I'm going to miss them. Just excited that we want to stay, you know, we came here to do it and we did, you know, so I'm so excited right now. In an 80,000 seat stadium, a school with 26 students became champions today. Probably ain't going to be able to see tonight, honestly, and, uh, you know, state champs, uh, it's pretty exciting right now. 